is a uh, mix of, there's some serious stuff in here, as well as some Don Rickles stuff. Uh, and you'll recognize uh, some of the words. A few key words come from people like Yip Harburg and Irving Berlin. And uh, let's see, who else is in here? Uh, Alan J. Learn, people that Dave likes. It's also based on what I know about his life. I know about his life very directly for the last 40 plus years, but he told me a lot about the life that preceded that, so that's in here too. Uh, the structure of this poem came from a uh, guy named Stephen Sondheim, uh, who Dave appreciates and I appreciate very much. And I tried to parallel uh, some thing that he wrote, and anybody who sits down to write something figures out very quickly that the writing gets away from you, and suddenly it takes over, and Somebody is speaking. So, it's not all serious, Dave. I hope so. <laughs> uh, as Judy said, good times and bum times. He's seen them all with good cheer and a tear. He's still here. Hendrix gin sometimes. Sometimes just pretzels and beer. But he's here. Born in the late 30s, the depression is taking its toll. He's just here. And his teenage mother trying to salvage body and soul. Brother, can you spare a dime? She stood on bread lines with the best, watched while the headlines told the rest. In the depression was she depressed with a brave veneer. But they survived it, and he's here. Could anyone among us have an inkling or a clue what the Great Depression or a World War II could do? After that war's terrible time, Anne met Alex, soon wedding bells chime. For Dave, a father who's there and sincere, shortly Judy, Steve, and Jerry up here. Now he's the big brother they sometimes revere, and he's here. Grew to adulthood in Old Monterey, entered the army, 20 bucks a week was the pay. He and other callow rookies whittled it away, but he got to see some of Europe on holiday, and he's here. Went off to community college on the VA, president of the student body, as he likes to say, telling this story nearly every other day. <laughs> <laughs> He's here. He got through African studies at UCLA, and he's here. I forgot some on the street, sorry. And Iowa City. And, and I wasn't getting this yet, Bill, by the way. Although she okay. Well, I'm, I'm trying to finish the other way. <laughs> He got through African studies at UCLA, and he's here, Iowa City, for a very short stay, but he's here. He married Barbara, moved to Northern VA. He's then in the rush hour of life, hostage to children, mortgage, and wife, and a little too much marital strife. Do you remember how we used to say we'd love each other every day, and now it seems uh, sadly strange that all these things can really Toddlers and in-laws, soccer and wine, proud of Reg and Jason, Dave's stressed, but basically fine. Makes a friend with Luba, she's a lifeline, and he's here. Heard Walter Cronkite in late 63 report what becomes a sad memory, announcing the killing of JFK, a searing, heart-wrenching November A sadness that never quite goes away. Ah, but he's here. Then Huntley and Brinkley have to say Bobby too on another bleak day. Thought it was over, but Dr. King had to pay. Seen all his dreams disappear, but he's here. Later met Mary through a classified ad. <laughs> 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 
I can usually remember Monday through Thursday. If you can remember Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, let's put our two heads together. <laughs> Call Dave at 703-533-6963, and she did. Mary impressed him readily, reciting Shakespeare from memory. To be or not to be, it doesn't matter much to me. Wherefore art thou, Romeo? You're the man I want to know. When he heard her say, the body hand of the dial is upon the prick of noon, <laughs> Dave began to swoon, flying to the moon, <laughs> or the corner saloon. You made that up. <laughs> No poetic license. Yeah. <laughs> or to rack and to ruin. Mary says, I don't like that tune you whistle night and noon, but I've grown accustomed to your pace. <laughs> Dave continued to praise Mary's remarkable ways, proving persistence still pays. <laughs> Dave said, I love you, which is easy to see, but I have to keep guessing how you feel about me. You listen to the words I speak, but I think it's with your tongue in cheek. He says Mary made the first pass. She says she was just a diffident lass, <laughs> reeking with class. But she's taught him to listen, thus saving his ass. <laughs> she tends the garden and mows the grass. Oxygen near, he now steers clear, so he's here. Dave's been to Vegas through L.A. and Beverly Hills, and he's here. Andrew's adolescence, briefer, vino, and quite a few pills, but he's here. I call him a liberal, a left-wing tool. He claims he's a moderate. He's nobody's fool. He could have gone to an Ivy League school. That seems clear. Couldn't afford the tuition, so he's here. AID hired him, thought he'd stay there. Found the State Department too rigid to bear. Then EDA called, where he spends the rest of his career, civil rights and public works, year after year. He should write his memoirs while he's still here. He's gotten through Nixon and J. Edgar Hoover. Man, that was fun and a half when you've been through Nixon and J. Edgar Hoover. Anything else is a laugh. He's been through Gandhi, Bill Clinton's sleazy affair, and he's here. Amos and Andy, Clarence Thomas, and a stray pubic hair. <laughs> Something quite rare to discuss on the air, yet historically fair. He's here. He loves the movies, Fred, Ginger, and Citizen Kane, the late Siskel and Ebert, some strangers on a train, John Ford's Wiss Western starring John Wayne. He even likes Percy Kilbride and Marjorie May. <laughs> he lived through Arthur Miller and Marilyn Monroe, Coppola's Godfather, Rita Hayworth, Far Down Below. He loves a Quentin Tarantino show, even Ingmar Bergman and all that depression and snow. Maybe he's really waiting for you to go. But he's here. <laughs> Tried the high desert, struggled to breathe the thin air, liked Albuquerque, but had to leave there. Checked out Winters and Davis, found Woodland more fair. Home to California, he can breathe easy. Here. So, he's here. April gave him a grandchild, Molly Lasky's her name, wish she were here. Now he's closer to family, the torture of a giant's game, the restaurants of San Francisco, Sotomare, Albona by name. <laughs> Met Joyce and David, good friends they became. That sounds like Yoda inverting the frame. <laughs> Dave's a bit of an addict with TV. TBS, PBS, and TNT. Wouldn't miss Southland or Justified each week. Rouses himself only to take a leak. Or he could be sitting somewhere else, cheek to cheek. <laughs> Masterpiece Theater, his regular gig, Glenn Close and Damage, he thought really big. Tapes Charlie Rose as his own late night sport. Calls the next day with a detailed report. Gives organ recitals of the physical sort. <laughs> Dentists and doctors offer moral support. Getting old, to which there's no retort. Our rebels now are ended. 
But he's still here. Good times and bum times, he's seen them all with good cheer and a tear. He's still here. Gray goose sometimes, sometimes just pretzels and beer, but he's here. He's run the gamut A to Z, three cheers and damn it, say la vie. He got through all of last year, and he's here. Lord knows at least he was there, and he's here. Look who's here, starting his 76th year. He's still here. <laughs>